Hi folks, welcome once again to a GazLab short video. Very, very quick one today. I'm just going to do an assembly of the Seed um, uh, Kiwi SDR um, for BeagleBone. Um, when you get this, um, this kit, you'll find inside that you have um, the green board SDR uh, Kiwi, Kiwi SDR, and on the back here you have the BeagleBone uh, small form factor PC um, or computer, whichever you like. You get a set of quick start instructions and you get the two aluminium frames for the case. You get the top and bottom acrylics. You get a bag of screws and rivets and you get a GPS antenna. Um, and also you get an SD um, an SD card with the OS on it. Um, just a little point to note that you do not need to install this. Okay, if you the first thing that uh, you should do on receiving this case, okay, is identify all the parts. Okay, take the box and take the SD card. Pop that in the box and put that away somewhere safe because you're not going to need the SD card unless something bad happens and you need to reinstall the OS which is pre-installed on these kits. So, what do you get? Well, you get the um, you get the SDR um, or the Kiwi SDR main board and you get the Beagle Bone and they're all pre-assembled. Now, what you would normally do is you would take the two frames the acrylics and nuts and bolts and all that and assemble that um, that up now the, the purists amongst you would probably say you know it should really be a metal um, case well it just so happens that uh, Kiwi SDR and Seed do actually produce a aluminium enclosure which I have here which I will assemble now now what you get in the case here I'll show you. Okay, I've unpacked most of this to save you a little bit of time. Okay, the Kiwi kit metal case um, obviously comes with a fan, some star washers, three brass standoffs, and one nylon standoff. You get a bag of screws there and one nylon nut. Oh, sorry, one nylon uh, screw. You get one nylon, looks like a washer there, and four um, rubber feet or silicon feet. You get the, um, the looks like the rear case, the front case, and then the two halves to the main case. And um, what I'm going to do now is put this together for you. Uh, so you can see how it all goes together um, and then what I'll do I'll do a second video where I show you how to actually set it up and uh, get the whole thing working and uh, you can not only enjoy your own SDR um, Kiwi Kiwi SDR but you can actually share it and if you if you join on to I think it's no IP then you can actually share that across the world and then you can attach that to the um, to the uh, the sdr.hu website which is a fantastic um, web-based um, sdr platform where you know thousands of uh, normally kiwi sdrs share the connection and everyone can then take part now the good thing is with the uh, sdrhu it's not just restricted to um, the kiwis you can attach it to sdr plays and all that sort of good stuff and really um, just enjoy the world of uh, sdr no matter where you are so let's get started and put this together. <laughs> 